Many of you here on my YouTube channel were incarnated during the times of Atlantis and Lemuria. And there is a powerful healing that needs to happen for you to feel that release from all those so-called karmic ties back to Atlantis and Lemuria and release all of that sadness, grief, injustice from your system. Welcome to my YouTube channel, my name is Sylvia Saul and I help lightworkers and starseeds to remember who they are. And this video is specifically for those of you who feel connection to Atlantis and Lemuria. Perhaps there is this magical land that you always felt connected to and you feel like you are missing this beautiful place, be it Atlantis or Lemuria. Maybe it's something that you have always known within yourself that there used to be such place and you feel almost like um, sadness when you think of uh, the fall of Atlantis and Lemuria. And you may feel like you are longing for those places. And a part of you hopes that Lemuria and Atlantis can be resurrected in some way. And while the latter is true and it goes deeper and I think I'll talk about it in another video the first part is something we need to address when um, the Atlantis and Lemuria fell when there was that last distractions of those places many mi millions of people died and many of you at that point you were healers you were light workers you kind of sensed or saw what was coming and maybe some of you were trying to actively stop it or do something against what was happening but you failed anyway and you are still getting that sense of failing within your soul for all those lifetimes there is still that burden that guilt shame anger injustice and deep deep sadness and it all needs to be released because hear me out what happened in Atlantis and Lemuria was predestined to happen before the beginning of time it was not your fault there was nothing you could do to stop it it was not meant to survive because everything um, at least within certain parts of the universe is evolving through specific evolutionary cycles and those are decided before there is even the first plant on the planet before there is first being on the planet and then the humankind needs to move through those evolutionary cycles and when Lemuria fell it was the time Yes, sure, it could have happened more elegant way, but it happened the way it was meant to. And the same for Atlantis, it was the time it needed to happen. Because it wasn't yet the final um, level of consciousness that uh, the human beings are able to achieve. And with the things as they were, they were not able to achieve it anymore. For various reasons, for each of those places. But the bottom line is that there was nothing you could do to stop it. So I want you to close your eyes and feel it with your soul and release it from your system. Let it leave. If you feel like you failed, if you feel sadness, if you feel grief, guilt, anger, injustice, release all of it. This is also one of the reasons why some of you are still around. Because you feel responsible for the fall. But it needed to happen regardless. And it was no one's specific fault. Of course, there were things that happened that were in play and people played different roles. But still, there is much higher meaning behind everything that happened. And so, the main takeaway for you is stay true to yourself. You cannot change certain things 
when it comes to evolutionary cycles, for example, we are just now stepping out of one huge evolutionary cycle and into another, and we are in the time of huge transition. The way it's going to unfold, or the results, are still a little bit, slightly in the open. There are still some details that are in the open. But the fact that it's happening, it was decided a long, long time ago, as I said before, the beginning of time. And so you focus on staying true to yourself, on living in alignment with your soul. But you cannot carry that responsibility on your shoulders for everything else that happens as a, at that collective level, because there are certain events that need to happen. Because through that purging, there is a much higher consciousness emerging from it as a result. So if you feel like you carry this gigantic burden on your shoulder as a light worker, if you feel like you have to save the world, it's likely coming from those times. And it's time to let it go. You cannot save the world as an individual. We all do it as that collective, through being connected to one another, elevating one another, creating new consciousness here through our mutual connection. But one person cannot save the world. And so if you feel this way, it's likely coming as some un unhealed wounds from Atlantis or Lemuria, or both even. <laughs> some got lucky, right? So some people got lucky and experienced the fall of both places, civilizations. And so release it from your system. There was nothing you could do to change it. I want you to really understand it and feel it with your soul. Okay, so I hope you found this video helpful. And please let me know in the comments below if you feel like you were incarnated during Atlantis or Lemuria or both. Let me know down in the comments. I'm really interested in hearing your experiences and maybe your memories. Thank you so much for watching and please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And see you in the next video.